Welcome to day 51 of the 100 day mindfulness challenge. My name is Miss Steer and today we're going to cool down warm emotions using breath. We're doing the cooling out breath. Over the last week or so we've had some really warm weather in the UK and at times it's been quite hard to deal with especially for hair therefore i thought it'd be useful to have a week where we focus on cooling down warm thoughts feelings moods and emotions so that's what we're going to do and today we're going to try that with actually using a breath that is very cooling i was taught this as being called the cooling o breath but you might have, have seen it before as the O breath, the mouth breath, or even the taco breath. Doesn't really matter what you call it, it's about what you do. So, what do we do? The idea with this cooling O breath is that we actually breathe in through our mouths and out through our nose. So it's a reversal of what we usually would do with our other breaths. When we breathe in, we stick our tongue out and then we close our mouth and breathe out. When we are breathing in and sticking our tongue out, if you can, you can roll your tongue like a taco, hence the name. However, if you can't do that, if you can't roll your tongue, because a lot of us cannot, then sticking your tongue out will achieve the same effect. Let's give that a go. Let's try three breaths like that. Now, it's important to get our posture right. And just the same as we normally do, I want you to make sure that you are sitting upright and awake. Bring your shoulders up towards your ears. Let them drop. Make sure that your breath can get nicely into your chest. So we want our chest to be open. Ideally, you want your feet on the floor as well. Okay, we're going to begin by sticking our tongue out and rolling it if we can, but just out is fine if not. And breathe in through your mouth. Close your mouth then and breathe out through your nose. Notice the sound of that breath. And we're going to do that again. So tongue out. I really want you to notice the cool air this time. Breathe in. Close your mouth and hold for a moment. And breathe out. If you want to, you can stick your hand under your nose. Feel that warm air. Really nice to let in cool air. Let out warm. And let's do this again. Breathe in. Nice, deep, cool breath. Close your mouth, hold and breathe out. Let that warm air out. And let's throw in an extra one. Why not? Breathe in. Hold and breathe out feel your body cool down how does that feel what did you like about that breath what did you notice about that breath can you feel any change in your body temperature in the way you feel in your mood or emotions Take some time now to discuss that with people nearby or take some thinking time, jot down notes even if you are on your own. Off you go. I don't know about you but I am feeling cooler already and a little bit calmer and maybe less annoyed. So for your challenge today, I want you to see if you can do that cooling O breath again. Just remember to reverse what we've been doing for the other breath. So you breathe in through your mouth and make sure you shut that mouth 
and the breath comes out through the nose. Remember, cool air coming in, warm air going out. If you can use this at a time when you're warm, either because you're just warm or because you're feeling some emotions that are making you feel a little bit warm, emotions may be like irritation, anger, boredom, frustration, sometimes those emotions feel quite warm inside, then even better. As always, you can share this to a wider audience. If you give an adult a nudge, they can share to Twitter, Instagram, Facebook. Details are on the screen. We are heading into the second half of our challenge now, the, the last 10 weeks. And that's going to take us all the way back up to schools being fully reopened and us all being in school in September. If there is anything that you'd like to see or any problems that you're hoping mindfulness could help with, then get an adult to contact me and I will do whatever I can to kind of solve those problems throughout the next 10 weeks. I'll get some activities in there that are based on what we need. I've had a good few requests in now and I have listened to them and I will be getting those things in over the challenge. That's it for today. Have a great day and I will see you tomorrow.